hearty soup provides goodness to nourish our bodies. Reading great stories provides goodness to nourish our minds. They inspire children to read in their own home language and then later on learn to read other stories in other languages too. That's why Cadbury Dairy Milk has called on you to play a part by translating words into home languages to help co-author a children's library full of African language storybooks. We have precious Kanyile Matebula on video call with us today as she'll be sharing with us her Siswati story for the week that has created from your translated words. So gather the kids and get comfortable as we're about to hear a magical story about a lonely snake. Welcome to The Loft, Precious. Hi, thank you for having me. Now, Precious, as someone who is just well-versed in the Siswati language, how important is this campaign to you, everything that Cadbury is doing? Mother's language is very important to our kids. They make things easy for them to understand. Precious, now, as you have explained quite beautifully how important this initiative is, do you mind telling us the name of the story you're about to read? And just go on and read it for us, girl. Okay, the story name is Inyoga Lenesitunye. Wasugasugela. Umvana ngungumbani wayenze tela wabuyela emuva esizekeni sakhe kungani letinye tinyoka letinye tilwane tingangithanzi mini yemake kwakhala umvana nyoka sonke isikhathi nangiphumela ngaphandle ngiyo dlala nato tiyabaleka tika tika kangibingeleli tingangikhulumisi Sebake beva tinzaba, letimbi, netinyoga, letilwane, titabanga. Titabanga kutsi tinyoga, atika lungi, tia sisaba tine. Washo mage nyoga. Umvana nyoga, abetibugela, asemuva kwelifala, lelinye, tilwane. Nesikatitizala Leti honga, tabalega tetfuga kakulu, takichima, tabalega ngaleskulu sivinini. Nia bonga, kwa shongu ngumbane, endo ndotel, kute inginga, kwa haza, umvana nyoga. Tala nami, leto tiluane, angege, tipinza futi, tiku totote, kuze gube ngunamusha. Inyoga na ngumbane, basala ganye ganye, ngegujabula, tostosi. <laughs> Precious, you read that with all the animation. I felt like I was in the story. But for some of our viewers who might not understand uh, your, your language, can you just explain very briefly what the story was about? So this story is about a little snake. So she came back home crying. Why are the other animals don't want to play with me? The mother explained to her they have ter terrible stories about us snakes. They think we are very bad. So she used to watch over a rock while other animals were playing there. So one day, Another animal was crying. He had a, a little cry. So he went there and checked. So when he checked, she found out that police bullying other animals. So he went there and scared away the police. So even today, the hedgehog and the snakes, they are pretty good friends. Wow. <laughs> so that's the story. I mean, how brilliant indeed. That's great.
<laughs> what I love about these stories is that it seems like they always have a happy ending mm. at the end of the day, but that's what it's all about. Now play your part and translate a word to help ensure that all children can enjoy enchanting African language tales in their own home language, just like the powerful Siswati story Precious just read for us. Don't forget to visit www.cadbury.co.za and at Cadbury Dairy Milk SA on Facebook or at Cadbury underscore SA on Twitter and Instagram to start sharing your own words today.